hello hello welcome back to divine destiny guide how are you sending you the purest of love and light god is for us who can be against us i love bringing you these messages of inspiration to encourage you so we're going to expose the haters let's see why they're hating on you let's see who is hating on you possibly and just get a little bit more details but if it's your first time welcome returning soul drivers new soul drivers thank you so much for your love your support couldn't do it without you please remember to hit the like button uh, that helps to push the videos the messages out so that others can also be blessed as well so from divine's lips to my ears to you let's catch up on some tea huh let's see why they are hating on you and for what and all this stuff the juicy stuff so at the top here off the bat it says it could be a business rival so this person cannot stand your grind and your hustle so for a lot of you you're hard workers you're driven you are determined your willpower it is irritating to somebody or somebody's so yes yeah, so this is somebody who you and them are probably in the same line of feel or you're working with them among them around them but they're definitely they're keeping an eye on you and what is going on over <laughs> your yard because they see that you're going you're doing your stuff your hustle your grind it stand out and yes this is why somebody does not like you at this time they don't like you for that they're hating that's what is coming out here they're hating on your spiritual or your psychic gifts omg yes so yes yeah, so a lot of these hater or haters that you have mm, uh, it says though I walk in the midst of trouble you will revive me you will stretch out your hand against the wrath of mine enemies and your right hand will save me Psalm 138 verse 7 wow so yes yeah, so they're hating on your spiritual gift God is protecting you hating on your spiritual or your psychic gifts this is why they're hating because they don't have the gift they don't have the calling on their life and that's why they're hating earlier when i was um pre-shuffling the cards i one fell out that says they're hating on your creativity so a lot of them they're not creative they're not divine beings so this is why they're jealous because of the things you're able to do so they're trying to block your shine they're trying to rain on your parade that's what i i get from from that there wow so a lot of these people they are hating on you let's see oh, spirit. yeah why are they hating on the soul tribers let's expose them who came out it says you will witness their karma wow so this is why they are upset because they know that they did too much they're doing too much and the fact that you're gonna be able to see them struggle you're you you may be able to see them go through it it's like the same traps they set for you the same holes they dig for you everything that they did to hurt you or come against you for some of you these people they they don't like it because you are gonna witness the things that they planned against you wow it says here lavender sage clears away negative thoughts energies harmonize the mind enhances intuition and inspires loving feelings so a lot of you they're probably hating the fact that you know how to clear your space how to cleanse your energy as well from all of these negative attacks that they're sending your way mm okay okay so a lot of them they're causing unexplained body pain and numbness yeah so this is what they're doing this is something that some of your haters could be doing there they want you or they're causing you to have unexplained body pain and numbness because they're sending you spiritual warfare your way but a lot of you you're cleansing away those negative energies as well wow 
<laughs> so a lot of you, you're doing your return to sender and it backfired on them. Oh my goodness. See, this is why you will witness their karma. Because again, every negative energy that they sent your way. And some people may say, oh, I don't believe in return to sender. Who feels it knows it? It's like sometimes you have to push back that thing back over there. It's not yours. I think it's just um, reciprocity. You know, it's like somebody give you something. You appreciate it. You say, thank you. If somebody send you something you don't want, you say, go. It's okay. That's fine. You send it back over there to their mama. Send it back to their puppy. You know, that's not your story. That's not you. Take back that energy. You know, so yeah. So a lot of you, yeah, this is why, you know, they are exposed. They're hating because they, you will witness their karma because everything they did to you, it backfired onto them. It says here, be aware of anyone from the past wanting to enter back into your life. Okay. So a lot of these people from your past, they may want to come back. Be aware of that because their motive is not right. Their motive is not correct. It says here, your significant other is sending you negative energy. Again, maybe this is that person from the past who is sending negative energy as well, who is, and you may be feeling it in your body, body aches that you never had, you never have, have those kind of feelings, numbness, tingling, all that kind of stuff. Because sometimes God will allow us to feel what they're blocking off of you. It's like what you're touching, <clears throat> what you're feeling is a very tiny of the remnant of what they're blocking off of you. But God wants you to be aware that something is going on. Things are happening in the spiritual realm. And that is just, you know, one of the, the things that's going on. You're feeling those unexplained pains and body aches and all of this stuff. Spirit team. Woo! Ancestors, angels, spirit guides, gods and goddesses, they got your back. You're protected. So your spiritual team, that's what I'm saying. And, and this card just fell out. Look, then it says copycat. Trying to be just like you and everything you do. So your, some of your haters could be copycats as well. Again, they have no identity. And remember I mentioned earlier, I saw the card that they're hating on your creativity. Because a lot of these people, they don't have, they lack that. And so they want to be like you, walk like you, talk like you, dress like you. You know, they're imitators. They don't have an identity for themselves. They're still struggling. They're still struggling. And, you know, it's very sad. But, yeah, they're trying to be just like you and everything that you do. But the, the beauty here is that you're protected. Your, your heavenly host army, they, they have your back. So yeah, so so again, the attacks, your haters could be your business rival because they hate your hustle, they hate your grind, so they want to slow you down, they want to block you and all of this stuff. They're hating on your spirituality, your gifts because they didn't get it. And so they, they hate the fact that it's you. And again, they're copycats, so they could probably be trying to pull it off they're trying to pull off that they have these gifts as well right and a lot of you you will you will witness their karma cleanse your space these people are sending you negative energies and some of those negative energies are coming from persons in your past who you consider to be your significant other you know be aware of anybody coming back from your past. It's saying, do your return to sender. A lot of you did that and now it's backfiring on them. And let me tell you, it's like we're co-creating with divine. While they're fighting up there in the spiritual, yes, in the spiritual we're fighting, we're helping too to cut and clear, cancel and release. And on earth, 
We are returning those things back to sender and we are clearing our energy. Some of these people, they're spying on you. Spying on you is a part of their daily routine. So it's like they don't like you, but they keep watching you. Why? Because they're trying to copy you. They're trying to be like you. They want to speak like you. So this is why they make you the first thing they get up in the morning. You're probably the last thing on their mind before they fall asleep at night. I mean, if I can be of any help, you know, you, whomever these people are, you know, it's like, it's not healthy. Mm. If you're not a hater, then, you know, you know, blackmail. So they're digging up dirt on you to use later. So maybe this is why they're spying. They're watching, you know, and it says they will play victim once they know they're losing. Yeah. So I love it for you. I think this is so good. I love it for you. So yeah, the haters are exposed. So for some of you, this is what's happening in your world, in our world. So please remember to like, share and subscribe. Until next time, take care. Be blessed.